Right now at 5, a teenager rushed to the hospital after collapsing in gym class. It physically talks to you and, and guides you through the situation. The life-saving decision the school made that it hopes other schools will make too. And now, from Minnesota's most watched station, this is WCCO 4 News. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us. A 14-year-old boy is alive today because of the quick response of school staff and a sheriff's deputy. Jared Loomis was in gym class when he collapsed in back of Rush City High School yesterday. He is now at Children's Hospital in St. Paul in critical condition. But as Reg Chapman shows us, it was the quick action by school officials and law enforcement that likely saved his life. Right back in this area here. Rush City High School principal Brent Stavick says at about 1.30 Tuesday, he was told a student collapsed 60 feet from the building's back door. As soon as the student went down, as soon as the first emergency team members got there, they knew when I came out the back door, they were yelling, we need to start CPR, and they were doing it as soon as I got there. Stavick says the PE teacher called 911. Another went for one of the two AEDs in the building, and the Chisago County Sheriff's Office was called. Right when our staff was getting there with our AED, um, the police vehicles started coming from over towards our elementary school there, and they drove right through the grass. Sergeant Jason Foster was close by and was there in less than a minute. There were some school staff, uh, teachers, uh, the Rush City principal. They were all uh, conducting CPR on this young man. I was able to get the AED out and uh, within 20, 30 seconds start applying shocks to try to revive this young man. Flip it open. Sergeant Foster has used this life-saving device before. It physically talks to you and guides you through the situation. Once they got a pulse, Foster, Stavik, teachers and staff knew their training paid off. Everything just fell into place and the stars aligned with this case. Literally the helicopter was able to land right there. Paramedics took over. Loomis was taken by helicopter to Children's Hospital and Clinics of Minnesota. Sergeant Foster says he is proud to be part of a team that helped save a life. The school did a fantastic job with their emergency response team and getting CPR started almost immediately. Now, Principal Stavik says he would like to see these AEDs in every building in Minnesota. Jared Loomis's parents want to thank the community for their thoughts and prayers.